So here's the thing, how you max out your military power with the least amount of gold. Okay. As you can see, <laughs> I got big ships and um, it has been fun. A lot of fun in this game. Um, so here's what you do. You see the reserves? Uh, probably not many people know this, but if you want to increase this to the max, it shows that the efficiency, discipline, melee, and, melee and the firearms will all decrease. Well, not really, okay? Let's try this. Because you don't want to go reserve, because you reserve, the gold will cost a lot, okay? You, want to, you don't want to reserve. And you want it, um, yeah, you don't want a reserve, okay? So, no reserve, it will bounce back up. Watch, okay? It has been update, upgraded. This is not a hack. <laughs> I, I, I assume this would work uh, with your version of the game as well, and uh, it will bounce back up. And then, now, this is what you do. You want to upgrade back to 60 soldiers again. Why? Because you create, you're using this guy to train your soldiers for the reserves, and now you have 660 reserves. Intelligence 100, dexterity 100, 99 100, 72 100. Okay, and you use the reserve to upgrade on your cruise ship okay because why 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 that is the case okay I'm just adding a, a, a captain here um, you want to do this because in the cruise ship this will not bounce back up uh, like what we did in the land in the, in the troops Okay, if, if you do reserve, okay, if you do reserve, then it will, the stats of your army will increase instead of decrease. So you're using the reserve that you just created to 60 to increase uh, the crew members on the ship. Okay, because wait, okay. Because 120, uh, if if without reserve, without using the reserve, this is gonna go down, and this will not bounce back up. So we use reserve to maintain the military power on the ship, uh, crew, on the crew on the uh, within the ship. Okay, and that's how you do it. Because if you do reserve, it will be a lot cheaper. If you don't read uh, wait. Okay, not, not, okay. Maybe not, okay. So, you do reserve. Right. But your efficiency is gonna go up. See, because if I don't do reserve. Okay, I'm gonna cancel it. If you want to increase it without the reserve. Upgrade, it will not ba bounce back up. But here, it uh, but here, uh, the six C, da 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 da, max out. It will bounce back up. You see that? And then you use this two sixty to create even more reserves, and you use reserves to put it on your ship okay see without the reserve this is increase a lot if you press reserve you're gonna start using the reserve and you can upgrade okay so that's it for this for this episode I know if you reserve I think uh, yeah the, the gold is for sure it's gonna be less right because you're using the reserve 
So I, I'm not sure why. Okay, let's try this. See, you're, if you're using the reserve, gold should cost zero, unless you're buying new weapons. Okay. One eight nine. And we have one 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 hundred eleven. You see. To minimum, two 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 zero. So basically, it's an increase. It's an increase, and we have some reserve of the weapons, and now the upgrade cost should be less. If you re if you use the cruise ship, uh, the reserve on the cruise ship to increase the crew on your ship, then uh, the cost should be less. And here, here, again. Um, this part, if you use reserve, uh, the cost will be a lot more, more expensive. And it's the same result. Okay, it's the same result. If you don't use reserve, it will be a lot less, and will still bounce back up. And that's it. Hope you guys enjoyed it. This uh, age of sail. Um, you using the cap basically is that you use the captain to train your troops, and you, after trained, they will have a better stats within the reserve that you can use on your ship. Okay. <laughs>